film fanatics. Crazy! It's crazy. They're nuts about that. Now, the Houston Film Fanatics. Hey, this is Marie and Ray with the Houston Film Fanatics. That's right, and we have something crazy to talk about this week. Ketchup, mustard, oh, sausages and buns. Sausage party. Yay! Super inappropriate movie. Absolutely. But you know what? I wouldn't have it any other way. I mean, do not take your child to this. And if you do, I will definitely call Child Protective Services on you. Marie will actually be monitoring uh, every theater. It's it's bad. Across the country. It's bad, but it's so good at the same time. Okay, so I literally watched this whole movie with my mouth hanging open the entire time. So much WTF happening. I had my hands on my over my mouth. I'm like, oh my goodness, what am I watching? Yeah. If you don't know, the premise of the movie is basically if our food actually came alive and had feelings and hopes and dreams and they lived in the grocery store and all they aspired to be was to be lucky enough to be chosen to go to the quote unquote great beyond, which is basically outside the supermarket. Which equals death. They're eating children! They're just children! But they don't know that. It's kind of like an adult toy story, right? Uh, yeah, but really more twisted. An adult, adult toy story. Yeah, so twisted. It stars uh, Jonah Hill, uh, Seth Rogen, Kristen Wiig, Edward Norton. I mean, Paul Rudd, just tons of people. Every possible actor you can think of, they're in this movie. Yeah, well, and it all comes from the minds of Seth Rogen, Evan Goldberg, and Jonah Hill. They're the guys that came up with the story. It was a great story. It was. It was super weird. It was hilarious, but very perverted. Uh, yeah, that's an understatement. When I go to, called Sausage Party. <laughs> when I go to the grocery store, I'm going to think super hard on what to get. Are you going to be buying hot dogs anytime soon? <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> How about no, bagels? <laughs> no hot dogs. No, no bagels. Definitely no bagels. I'm going to go get some tacos later today. No, though. please don't. <laughs> you know, these jokes get funnier once you actually see the movie. <laughs> <laughs> it was really good, though. I think critics probably will be a little rough on this one, but like... It was, it was different. It was way different. It reminded me a little bit, a very little bit of the Book of Mormon. Because in a, in a weird way, they're kind of like poking fun at religion and just mm-hmm. blindly following things without questioning anything. Everything we believe is a lie. They were super racist in this movie. So much. Just, oh my God. I just, I couldn't believe what I was watching. Well, no, no group is safe in this movie. I mean, they no. make fun of everybody. Every nationality you can think of. It's like all of the seasons of South Park crammed into <laughs> one movie. <laughs> Where we they just we don't care we're making fun of everybody with a little bit of uh, porn, a lot of porn, <laughs> just a little bit. I mean, if you've ever <laughs> wanted to see a like a produce orgy, this is your movie. Why would you even say produce orgy? Well, I, it's, it's you're right. I'm being I'm, I'm being exclusive. There's also alcohol involved in the orgy yes. as well as some appliances. Let's not talk about that. Never again. Is, so is, this, is this okay for radio? I guess it has to be. <laughs> I didn't give any details. I'm just going to let you guys go to the theater and see for yourself. No spoiler alerts, though. But it did get a lot of, like... This is one of those movies that we missed at South By, but I really, really was hoping that we could see it. So I'm glad that we did. It was worth the wait. Or at least I think it was worth the wait. I think it was. I agree. You think there's going to be more movies like this after this one? What if there's a part two? Because they went... Oh, wait. I can't. I can't. Oh. Spoiler alert. No. I'm not going to do that That's actually Marie's new name is spoiler alert. I'm not going to do that. But there could possibly be a part two, like a sequel. It's The option's there. I don't know how much further we can get with this. How how much dirtier can you get with this first one? I don't know. I mean, there's literally a step-by-step scene on how to, like, shoot up bath salts in this movie. It's very, very informative. Very, no, very educational. That's literally the opposite of educational. <laughs> that's how to be not educated. Oh, Shoot up bath salts. That's not good. I'm aware. Porn, drugs, and hot dogs. Lots of hot dogs. Or there's sausages. And buns. They're more like the bratwurst. I really like those cheese wursts. Have you ever had those? No, I've never. <laughs> I can't talk about food like this. This is such a weird way of talking about food. So what are you doing for lunch after this? Uh, I'm not eating ever again. <laughs> the cuts are doing this to us because we touched tips. <sighs> it wasn't even that. I mean, it was fine. It's not like anyone writes home and says, oh, God, I had the best tip. You have to see this movie. Yeah. And, you know, I think it's one of those films that you need to get a group of just whatever your most laid back friends are. Mm-hmm. You know, everybody's got that group. Of friends where you kind of separate them into like different like categories where you've got kind of your more uptight conservative friends. Those guys stay home this weekend. <laughs> you need to get your crazy 
you know, your your college frat guy friends, your sorority girlfriend. Get those guys. Get them together. Go have some drinks, some beer, some wine, and then go see Sausage Party. But don't eat a hot dog. I'm just saying. After you see this movie. Do it during, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> Show what kind of monster you really are. Oh, sausage Party comes out August 12th. We got our full review posted at the blog page at kprcradio.com. And if you check out the movie this weekend, be sure to let us know what you think in the comments section. Together, we can fight these monsters and take control of our own lives. Come on, join the fight!